Hello. This is my Mr. Mike, Mr. Mike the Train Man again. Um, this is my fifth video. Um, I just wanted to show you what I've done a bit. I could take some photos and keep taking photographs to uh, show you what what I am doing um, on the. Uh, excuse me a minute. A bit of chat in the way there. Um, so I'd rather make another video to show you what I've done. Um, this is the dummy rail car. Um, I was going to make a three rail car, but it, I can't. I'm not bothered to find another coach. So uh, I put the, the train, the seat in this one, um, and you can see Martin the driver waiting to go. He's looking at his watch. And there's a couple of passengers just to show you what it's going to look like. Um, and uh, obviously the door, the doors have got to go on. Um, that's the control box, which is very similar to the uh, Liverpool overhead railway. And uh, there'll be a number three in that square in the middle uh, front. Between the two windows, which is that. Uh, and then there's the roof, which is just a white undercoat at the moment. But um, that'll be, and then all this, that'll be put on. And they've done a few more little coat, spray coats on it, you'd say. <coughs> um, the what's the name? The uh, it's got to be varnished outside and inside. It's going to take ages. I might put some fancy brown wood on to make it look a bit different. Um, I'm not going to stain it. I've still got to put the seats on. The the power bo the power bogey. So I don't know whether to put them lengthways down there or like that one. And um, there's the control panel and box cab like the other one and then there's the fire extinguishers ready um, and the number three so uh, and there's the roof again so that those because of it I've got two rail cars if I did the third one in between there it means it's going to be dead long you know talking three foot and then I've got to make the platform the same so I've just done it two at the moment I know it's so it looks very similar to an overhead railway, but not quite. And also, while I was doing it, waiting, I made a. I know I put photographs on it, but I made a tender loco uh, out of that black one. So I'm going to paint that black, and then the front of there, I paint that back to red. Um, now I can pull things, because when I had it before, I couldn't pull anything much. I kept had to tie it on with a bit of um, plastic band or something. So now. And it's real that's real coal which I got a grain. Uh, yeah, I've had a few donations of people which I'd like to thank them for. Um Dave uh, from Bromber who uh, donated a couple of engines and some track and um vehicles and that for the double O plus um I don't know if you can see there's a the board that that board there that's for the double O but with the debating whether there's a move or not, I haven't got space yet here. Um, also, um, Graham for donating uh, engines, which you know is uh, good of him. That one, um, the one that's the, uh, uh, Dave's power. Give me that one, sorry. Power in that one. Uh, I've got another one, uh, and uh, a couple of coaches, which is there. I've got all this stuff under here, which I've got to get out because originally it was going to stick. Um, a double O under here, but uh, I don't know if I'll get it underneath there or if I do, I'll have to chop that board up to get it under there. So I have two layouts. Depends if we stay here or if we're not. We'll still wait to listen uh, here. But, well, we're going to see the flat on Tuesday, but it's a lot of messing. Anyway, that's by and by. But uh, yeah, so I've got to get sort all this out. But yeah, I'd like to thank Graham and Dave and everybody that's. Uh, Give me bits and pieces to keep the layout going. And Martin, uh, you got um, Maisie for the track. You know, uh, everyone has been so kind. Um, donations, donations, and that for the uh, for the layout, Bicky, and the OO layout. So when I when I do that, I don't know what I'm going to make it. <laughs> uh, what name I'm going to call it? So I say. Uh, I hope you liked the video I did the other day. With it outside the bait shop. There's pins, he's got an helicopter on top of his uh, shop now. Um, 
when I was saying about these minis, by the way, I've got 15 of these. Well, it so happens I've now got a double O mini to start that collection off. So whether I get 15 of them or not, I don't know. There's the tank that I had to go with Tatty Knickers. That's the old dollhouse uh, little engine that was, I made. Well, I'm not going to do it now because it's another scale which you've got to find space for. Um, oh, sorry. <laughs> What was the way is when when you're videoing something for somebody, you always make a bloody cock up. Anyway, that's the door. I haven't got to fix that yet. But uh, anyway, there's a uh, what's that? Oh, cool. Um, I put a bit of weight to pick wobbly lots or anything, which I think it's the bogies because they're only uh, they're only cheap, uh, not cheap, but plastic. And I don't want to think of some way of putting a washer in there to sort of you know so it doesn't melt wobble so much. Um still got Septimus and all that with and um Titan and PC Catcher and uh, I've made um I was gonna chop that up uh, Thomas and make it into uh, uh an uh, uh, an engine for the GM fifteen but I've put the cab back on and I've got a proper front to go on there rather than Thomas's face so that'll go on the double O so I've got Quite a bit of stuff to go on a double O in a couple of engines anyway, some coaches, um, etc. Uh, I say it's waiting to see whether we move or not, and then I've got to you know if we do decide to stay here, then I've got to make the double O fit in this, um, because hands closed are here. And anyway, uh, that's what I've done so far. So I thought to be I've got a police station well better. That's what I've done so far. It's just um, no more motorbikes. I'm gonna make a motorbike shop as well as a mini shop. If it's you know um, whether I get it all on here, I don't know. Anyway, folks, uh, thank you very much for uh, you know looking and uh, supporting me, uh, watching all my videos and uh, the comments on Wiki Whirl and things like that. And uh, take care and have a good day. Good day, and we'll see you soon. Cheers now. Bye.